What's up guys? I finally made it to the lake. Hoover Campground over in Detroit Lake. My first trip out here this year. Bought the cars. This was pretty empty. Out of all the campgrounds and places to go, this was pretty empty. But uh, I got some power bait, some lures. I got my fly rod. Well, let's see if there's any fish that want to bite. Stay tuned, guys. Alright, I got one sitting over there. I got one on a stringer. Just throwing a spoon. Like my third cast since I got sitting out here. I hooked one. I had one hit. There's a fish. Oh hell yeah. Oh hell yeah, baby. This is a nice fish. Spinner just broke off and he fell in the boat. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Holy shit. There goes that rooster tail. My line is twisted to be hell for some odd reason. It's gotta be that rooster tail. There you go, I my tip. I have no idea what happened here. I really don't want to lose this fish. This one's bigger than my, those other ones. Oh, dang it, man. Oh, he was bigger than the ones, all the other ones. Losing him. There's a fish just at the water. He's not even fighting. Now he is. I'm not gonna keep this guy. Oh, he's pretty. Don't hook me, buddy. Didn't even have to touch it. Best way to release a fish, not having to touch it. Got my anchor, so I'm just gonna kind of float back. I let the current and the wind kind of take me back towards the truck. I'm gonna be calling it a day, for the most part. I'm gonna do some fishing on the way out. See if I. There's a fish. Yeah. Yes. 
Guys, I'm getting out of here. I've had my fun. I'm getting hungry. I've been had a really long day. Fish Devil's Lake on Friday, day before uh, yesterday. Oh wait, no, wait, wait, what's today? No, I actually, I fished the Devil's Lake yesterday, Saturday. Went home today at Detroit Lake. I went and fished the Sanium River. That's my favorite place to fish right this time of year. Anyway, you know, like always, thank you for watching my, you know, my videos. And if you liked them, please like and sub, subscribe. I'll be doing videos often, very often. Like I have always said before, thank you, tight lines. Have a good day. Yeah, thanks for watching. And if you guys stay tuned, I will be posting the videos and pictures that I got from the Devil's Lake. We caught some yellow perch and a couple of trout. Anyway, hope you like it. I got me yellow perch. My first yellow perch. Ever? Yeah. I have not caught one of these yet. Oh, yeah. There's a fish. Yep. I bet you it's another perch. Whoa, shit. May not even be a perch. It's swimming in with me. Whatever it is. Watch it be a bass and you gotta take these species. This ain't this ain't a trout, dude. Yeah it is. I really don't want to keep it. Unless you were planning on eating it. Oh. Yep. Right. Hell yeah, dude. Look yeah. On the dock. Gotta be a dude. Whoa, there's another one. It's a trout. Definitely not one I really want to keep. But yeah, it's a nice looking trout. I've kept so much trout, I'm not in the mood to keep trout. Hold on, buddy, hold on. There you go, buddy. Thanks for the little entertainment. What, is the bite about to turn on? I've been reeling super duper slow like this. I've been noticing, I've been try, trying to slow it down I, and they've been hitting. I don't know if that is the trick or not. Did it once and I'm like, nah, I appreciate the people that do it though. A what? Oh hell yeah, dude! A perch! Oh. Holy crap, dude! You got that's badass. Oh shit, where am I? Oh, I'm still. Oh, I'm still pretty far out there. That's a decent size one. What you do is you cup their head. And then you go down with their hand. Yeah, he's hooked. He's hooked pretty good. Yeah, you cup their their body and then go down on them. That's how you get their fins to not poke you. Yep, pretty much like that. That that's so cool. Fuck yes.
Oh, I, you don't gut them. No, you flay them. I mean, you could gut them and cook them that way, but every time I see somebody, they just flay them and they get the meat off the skin. But it, it, flaying these fish won't even take long at all. Uh, but you can gut them and cook them that way too if you want to. I mean, because then you don't have to gut it. You just cut the meat off the back and then toss the rest. I'm so stoked about using these out here. I'm going to start targeting these out here. Whoa, there's a fish. Oh, I missed them. 